Well, hey y'all, it's Nancy today. I'm fixing to leave. I think I'm leaving tomorrow, but I might not get around to it. But um, you see here, I got all these bags of stuff. I've been putting um, soil conditioner, like that's bark, little chopped up bark and, um, and soil on top of it around all mom's trees and bushes and such. Make it, um, make it all more healthy. And so she'll have flowers to look at. And there's a big dip as you try and get in the driveway. So I've got all this quick crete. Hope it doesn't fall out the door while I'm riding or break my door window. You know. So my brother's come up today. He's coming up to see me off. See me before I leave. But I ran out and went to the store just before he arrived. Because he was going to help me paint, I thought. And I thought I better get some paint. I really have no energy for painting today, though. But anyway, maybe I can mix this some concrete and put it down today. I don't know why I keep getting into more projects and projects and projects. I finished so much of what I was doing. I did the insulating in the attic. And I got Mama's cell phone for her car. And I got her car tuned up and got my car tuned up and got my, um, my winter tires off. And I got... Um, tune up for my car, I did my brakes, and I I made a pine needle basket on the wall for mom, and I made her a willow basket garbage can, and I made a willow letter basket, and I made some plastic strap letter baskets, which are a little bit tippy. I have to reinforce them with some green steps. Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to get out of there yet. I like being there too. It's really nice being with my mom, especially when it's a nice day. But I'm really ready to just go to the beach and lie there for a few days. Just relax, you know, do nothing. Set up a hammock somewhere and just chill. That's what I would like to do. I think my comfy is sliding over. This gets the door, I guess lock all the doors there. Haven't been uploading a lot of things. I guess I should get more uploaded. Boy, that was quite a thing with all these tornadoes we've been having. Man alive. So I got mom set up with some of those weather radios. I've got one for downstairs in the basement for where she's going to go hide with batteries in it. And another one for up um, in her in her bedroom, you know, and then one for the living room. Maybe it's overkill, but she has a hard time getting around, so it'd be nice if she's got everything where she needs it. And I've been planting millions of flowers. I've done petunias, dianthus, um, uh, gardenia bushes, and this morning early I, I went out and I got, oh yeah, I fixed the entire um, slope where it was eroding away off of the edge of the driveway. It was just a big cliff there into the woods. So I built it up with 50 bags of, is that right? It was 37 and then I did 20 so it was 57 and then I did 2, 4, 6, 7 today. 57 and 7. 60, 50, 54. So I did 54 bags of compost from people's yards, you know, the leaf and mulch. And I, I emptied them out and threw them down there and then I covered them with soil conditioner and then mushroom compost. And then I dug up my dad's garden area, his perennial bed, some of it, and I took all the monkey grass, which was pretty darn thick in there, and I threw that down on top of the soil on that cliff, which is now a gentle slope, and I planted two, two groups of grasses, ornamental grasses. They should get to be four feet, like a, a, a yard, cubic yard is about the size of them. So I put two of them in there, one out more toward the edge of the slope and one at the, near the house edge. So it'll, um, those will grow and root well. And I've painted, I, I, I 
scrape, my brother helped me scrape one side, you know, one small area above the roof. There's a wall there above a lower roof. So he helped me scrape that off. And then we put the primer paint on that. And then I scraped all the other sides of the house where it was peeling, just where it was peeling. I bleached the house. Then I paint, I, I scraped the paint there and then I um, primed it. And then I spot painted on top of the spot priming. I painted the whole one side above the roof. And then I just painted part of it on other places where I had spot primed. anything else I think? I completely cleaned out my dad's office. My dad was a professor with lots of research going on so he was he had piles of books and papers and bills and all this things that really needed to be filed and and he had old computer equipment that needed to be getting rid of. So all that I went through all that and I got rid of all that stuff and I filed things that were, you know, to save from his life and his work and then other finance, you know, well, whatever, household paperwork. I filed everything, got everything done. So that room is, and washed the curtains and I cleaned out the air conditioner in there. So that room is now all nice and ready so my mom can have a room for an office. And I also worked on his bedroom. There were things that were piled up in there on the beds so those are all cleaned up so that room is all nice and tidy now and I arranged the basement for mom so that if she um, if she has to go down in the basement for a tornado she's got a place down there where she can sleep and with um, emergency equipment and a radio and water and whatever she'd need down there even a commode that should be coming today and then I, um, I think there was something else oh yeah and then I insulated the whole ceiling above the dining room where it's, it's to keep the air conditioning in So I've been here a month. This is one month today. It's the 29th to the 29th. I feel good about what I've done. I did a lot of yard work, mowing the lawns. I got rid of some of the um, other stuff. Okay, well I guess I gotta go because now it's time to unload this concrete. Bye!